Um, so I spent uh, one year working for Kellogg's in food safety and quality uh, in a factory in North Wales where we made um, brown flakes, all brown, special K, fruit fibre and lemons for the whole of Europe. Um, so my role included investigating food safety and quality incidents. So when we um, had a problem in the factory, I would look into it from a food safety point of view, isolate the food that we think has been affected, and then sort of have it aside as non-conforming, as we're not going to send it out to market, and then sort through it in terms of uh, risk, um, and decide whether we're going to send it to animal feed, so scrap it, or send it out to, um, for human consumption. So for me, an undergraduate, that was quite a big, I felt like there was a lot of responsibility. Like, but actually, I think you're, when you listen to the others, we, when you go on placement, you do have a lot of responsibility. It is a real job. So it's really good, um, really good experience. So for example, um, you'll find in a lot of food factories you have a problem with... Um, you have a lot of moving metal parts, so you have a lot of risk of metal shards getting into the food stream. So one of my main tasks was, to, um, when we had a lot of metal rejects on the metal detectors, was to identify the source of the problem and um, see what food had been affected during this time, speak to the food safety manager and decide what we needed to scrap and what was safe for human consumption. So with my manager I was making decisions on um, scrapping like thousands of euros worth of product so that was quite like a really good um, experience of this is real life food this is somebody's money this is shareholders money and we're just going to throw it all away so it was, it was pretty um, sort of exciting in a way um, obviously it had quite a lot of false alarms because as you know we supplement um, cereals with dietary iron so that was a bit of a nightmare we had a big clump um, I ran morning food views with the production managers and you can imagine a production manager's um, main target is to get kilos out the door. What we want to do is make loads of food and <coughs> make our targets and then I'm going in as quality and saying you want to send food out the door but I want it to be as best quality as possible. So that was a really interesting dynamic like um, speaking to them and making sure like what adjustments could we make on the plant to uh, have throughput but at the same time having it really good quality. Um, so just to sum up, I really enjoyed working at Kellogg's in particular. They're a really good company and they were, um, they taught me a lot. I made a lot of lifelong friends and um, they also promote healthy living and an ethical company, which was really important to me when I was looking for a placement. Um, I'd encourage young people to study food science because um, it's a good balance of chemistry, biology and physics, so you're not doing just one thing, you're balancing all the sciences at once. Um, at college I didn't think I was very good at science and I thought I, I can't do any of these science -y subjects at uni because I'm not very clever. But when I came to food science, it turned out that because there's a physical example for every single um, science process, in many, many lectures it is milk, but um, <laughs> um, it helps you visualise and understand um, that there's a you know, there's a reason why we study food science and at the end of the day people need to eat so they need people like us to make sure it's safe and good quality. And the job opportunities are limitless as the food companies are among some of the biggest companies in the world so even if you start off as a food scientist you can then go actually I quite like this type of job, I quite like that, that type of department so then you can just move within these big companies. And um, also if you are deciding to be quite academic there are really interesting um, areas to research, so things that are really improving people's health, um, and I think we'll discover through.